is a technical analysis of the S&P 500 futures and um, we had a uh, primary trend line off the April highs of 2020 here a lot of minuscule reaction in between these uh, in between these candle and wick sticks and uh, we've had plenty of reaction to validate it here I really like it and uh, we 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 uh, we broke that uh, 4461 level that I had talked about in my previous, actually the very last video. And we have effectively put in a sell signal. This is a sell signal off the uh, daily time frame here. And uh, we'll see. We'll see how this uh, sort of pans out. You know, bulls might step in here for a little counter trend rally. Um, you know, and then you could have an objective entry short right there right at that uh, 4461 level if not you could start scaling at that 4357 if we even get there um, and then I'd suspect a, a rejection right off of it you know bulls want to see this right here you know or at least come back down um, but uh, you know we could see a couple little bounces and uh, I suspect some pretty uh, pretty good wave of, of uh, selling that I still, uh, you know, for reason, many various reasons that I had mentioned previously, but uh, yeah, we'll see how it plays out. We put in a three outside down bearish, followed by a falling three mat to the pattern, and we broke it. I mean, this is a crack, beautiful looking sell signal, as good as it gets, and I suspect there'll be uh, more downside in, in, in the indices to come. Remember, this is the top 500 companies really in the world top biggest 500 companies of the US stock market and um, S&P 500 goals then a lot of the stocks all over across the board are going to take too.